My friend JJ is a really interesting person, and you can tell just by looking at what he owns in his apartment. As I'm transitioning from living with eight roommates to living on my own, my friend JJ, let me stay at his place. I'm JJ, you can stay at my place. When you first walk in, one of the first things to notice is the sheer amount of books this guy has. This guy loves learning. You might assume he leans one way politically from some of the stuff he owns, but what I see is a love for learning about culture and history, and clearly video games. <laughs> I went to cook one day and could only find one pot, so I looked for a pan, and you'll probably guess what I found. That's right. Right? More, more books. You would think they'd be cookbooks, but they're all in Japanese. Does he speak Japanese? He later told me that he used to teach English in Japan and would use the books to have his students teach him about their culture. He likes to sit on an exercise ball when he works, but sometimes sits like this. He always has a picture of whoever the current US president and vice president is on his wall, and he sleeps in a comfortable loft bed. You really get a good view of the whole place from here. I'm fascinated by JJ's love for learning about the world and how he's able to spark that same fascination in other people like me. And those are only some of the reasons why I think